We're at the Marriott Courtyard hallway that won't end. We're looking for our rooms. 42, but all these are 44. Yep, back the other way. It's like The Shining. Good morning, Miami. We just went out, got our Starbucks. <laughs> now we're uh, tooling about the hotel for a little bit. Then where are we going? Then we're gonna get on a cruise ship. A cruise ship? Which cruise ship? Royal Caribbean. Where are we going to go? Uh, the ABCs. Plus the one, two, threes? Then the one, two, threes. And what is um, Haiti. Haiti, someplace I told you I would never, ever take you. <laughs> That's very true. We're not going to the Haiti I used to live in, though. We'll be all right. All righty, off we go. So, we are in our very first Uber. Uber, Uber. So. <laughs> It was very we easy, surprisingly. Crazy easy. So we watched these folks wait for the Royal Caribbean bus that was an hour late to take them down. While we were waiting for our shuttle, we booked to the hotel that was also a half hour late, um, still hadn't showed. We gave them a call and they said, hey, we, we already passed by. They didn't. We've been out there for over an hour. And so the girl at the hotel said, well, let me show you how to use Uber because, you know, we haven't used it before. So three minutes later, Luis, that's Luis up there. <laughs> shows up taking us in this awesome car for less than the shuttle was to get out to the cruise port so we will now be using uber whenever we're in miami and probably about anywhere else yeah unless of course luis takes us off somewhere and kills us then you will never see this <laughs> but he seems like a nice guy so this tunnel goes under the bay yeah. just got to the cruise port going through all this craziness got to dodge these bags luis was fantastic Hey, if I got on the road, we're gonna die. So there are a lot of people here. Theoretically, we're supposed to have a priority check-in, like VIP check-in, but we will see how that works here in a moment. All right, we just got checked into our ship in like 20 minutes. It was awesome. So we're walking down a hallway, a long hallway. Don't tell anybody, but Katie might have gotten us lost. Here's our cool little room. We even have a couch. Whoa, enormous bathroom. Let's see you get into that shower. <laughs> so this is a pretty big freaking ship. Your legs, your stomach, your bum, your arms, your thighs, your inner thighs. It's brilliant. He says, it's easy, he says. It's pretty good. So you may find this surprising, but uh, we just got on the ship and wandered around. I'm thinking overeating may become a problem. <laughs> it's pretty good. This is just us hanging out, getting ready to listen what to do if everything goes to hell. We're going to practice our evacuation drills. Then probably go back and get to eating again. Yeah. Pretty much, in, uh, let's see, in about an hour we get to actually go to the formal dining room and have dinner. How's that watch working? It's pretty good. Hi, good afternoon, everybody, and welcome on board. I'm going to start. And this is your motion station. Thank you, sir. Oh, you're very welcome. Very good. Loan that nice lady over there my glasses because neither of us can see without. <laughs> no, I mean, they may look like we're sitting here eating dinner. Yeah, but to me, it's our last dinner with hair and a beard. Month. Let's go find that haircut. <laughs> oh. What in the hell is she talking about? I don't get it. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yeah. It looks good, buddy. Yeah. That's nice. Ta-da! <laughs> this is Rafael, the best hairstylist in the fleet yes. from Colombia, <laughs> from Bogota. Yeah. Colombia. And how long have you been with Royal Caribbean? Two years. Two years? Two years now. And how long cutting hair? Been styling? Eight. 14. 14 years. That's why he's awesome. <laughs> Thank you again.